Okay, and welcome. This is uh, probably going to be the last video on this training series. Uh, we've covered quite a bit of information, how to do pages and posts, and how to install your plugins and your widgets. Again, um, you can't learn this stuff overnight. Uh, the key is just to, to keep learning and then building your website. By all means, call me with any questions. Or send me an email. I've been doing this for a while, so it's you know I probably got four or five years of working WordPress blogs. So there's a lot that I just can't cover everything. <clears throat> You'll encounter situations that you come up against. Uh, by all means, just make a note of it. Send me the uh, email or call me and I'll, I should be able to walk you through it. <clears throat> now on this one, we're going to actually show you how to put a video. And see, I've got a video right here. Um, and if you come up to my blog, there's a video here that you can click and it, 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 it allows them to learn a little bit more about me. This is my YouTube video account. Um, I do go over video training and how to market with videos. So I'm not going to do that right now. <clears throat> if you don't have one yet, you'll have to go to that training and learn how to set one up. But basically you want to shoot a video and I do recommend that you do this. And we're just going to go to video manager. This has all my videos. I would recommend that you shoot a video. It's important that your prospects can connect with you and um, have an association there. And there's no other way than a video. Sometimes it can it seem a little uncomfortable or you, you don't uh, feel just right and, and that type of stuff. But as you get doing more videos, it gets much easier to do. So I'm basically at this training. Uh, stage I'm just saying hey I'm pretty sure you've got a video and you just want to know how to get it on your on your blog so if you went to your tube um, and I just click on whatever video I want to um, display on there and we'll just pause that and what you do is you come down here to share you click on share you go to embed Uh, I always use the old embedded code. Don't use the HTTPS or the privacy enhanced. For some reason, it doesn't like to work with WordPress as much. I always do the 480 by 360. You can change that if you want uh, a little smaller or whatever, but that always seems to work good. Just click on it. It'll highlight automatically. Just copy that. You come back over. Copy that code. We just copied all this code right here. And you want to copy all that. You come back over to widgets. Um, and what you'll do is you'll just drag a text over. Stick it in. You'll just post that, that script in there. And then you can just put, you know. Just, you know, anything you want. Message uh, from Gerald about GDI or why GDI is work for me, or whatever you want to put in there. And you just save it. <clears throat> and then what it'll do is once you've uh, saved it, then you'll it'll be right in here. You can just click there and your video will be there. And then when you go to your page and look at it, you'll see that the video's popped up here. And people can uh, they just click on it and watch the video right from your website. Okay, that pretty much wraps it up for web creation. Uh, this will basically get you in, get you going. Again, any questions, feel free to call me or send me an email. And I'll see you at the next training video. Thanks.